Hello guys, welcome to my channel today as I'll be talking about the project known as Instarize and this project has actually made a lot of waves within the Tezos ecosystem and they're planning to release their new DEX, uh, Instadex, anytime soon and this DEX is expected to become the leading feature of DeFi in the Tezos ecosystem. Uh, so uh, Instarize is actually uh, the first ever decentralized init uh, initial DEX offering platform which is built on Tezos and they support projects to raise funds, build communities and turn ideas into projects. So they are live on Mexi Global uh, Exchange. Instaris actually allows token-based projects in the Tezos ecosystem to fundraise and they do this via their swap pool based on a, uh, a purchase rate of tokens. The swap pools are fixed and they are able to maintain the token price throughout the duration of the sale until the, so the supply is sold out. Instaris offers projects uh, built on Tezos the ability to fundraise and exchange capitals in a cheap fast uh, uh, and secure manner and Instaris also offers uh, instant liquidity provisioning via QuipoSwap which is facilitated in a very secure uh, manner as well. So Instarize offers a number of services. Uh, they have a decentralized launch pad for new projects on Tezos. Uh, users can provide liquidity on the pairs of projects which they may be interested in. And they can also stick into pools of their choice to earn incentives in terms of project tokens. Uh, Instarize also serves as an incubation for projects with the sole aim of mentorship. And they have uh, a decentralized exchange where tokens can be traded in an instant. Uh, Instarize also offers uh, ecosystem partnership, helping uh, you to reach out to Instarize network of partners in order to create new uh, collaborations. Instaris is offering a unique decentralized exchange known as Instadex and here tokens can be traded in an instant. Through this DEX offering, Instaris is repositioning itself as a vital member of the Tech Tezos ecosystem. So at the moment there exist uh, to a total of seven different uh, decentralized exchanges on the Tezos blockchain and Instadex is seeking to become the eighth one. And for it to be able to do this then it must be bringing some very serious level of innovation to the forefront. Uh, this will eventually make her assert a position within the Tezos uh, DeFi blockchain space. So Instadex offers a number of novel features such as impermanent loss protection as well as uh, single asset liquidity provisioning to traders and liquidity providers. Now, a few decks may be able to offer these features, but uh, the integration of uh, Instarize uh, will serve to be a new revolution within the Tezos blockchain. Now, a number of problems uh, which um, these automated market makers face actually makes it difficult for liquidity providers to want to provide uh, liquidity uh, within their systems. So Instadex is aiming to solve one of the most daunting problems, which is impermanent loss, uh, which hinders users uh, from providing liquidity on the Tezos blockchain space. This problem has affected traditional automated market makers, and um, it becomes very difficult for people to provide liquidity. So what does it mean to provide liquidity? Here, you simply mean submitting your tokens to a pool that is needed for a DEX to have functional trading pairs. So a user can provide um, liquidity to a DEX in the form of digital assets, and as a result of uh, certain factors, uh, the value of the assets a user own in the liquidity pool can drop significantly and this results in a state of impermanent loss. And the value that is earned uh, in the share is not always uh, fully compensate for this. So this becomes a huge challenge for most decks as users are no longer willing to provide uh, liquidity. So what is, there is also um, the problem of involuntary token exposure where the liquidity providers need to involuntarily uh, take exposure on each asset present in the pool just to participate in it. This makes a liquidity provider who do not want, wish to expose his or her favorite assets have no choice but to unwillingly uh, expose these assets just to be able to participate in the pool. So Instaris offers a number of so solutions to these uh, two major problems facing automated uh, market makers and we'll be looking at these so solutions one after the other. Now, Instadex uh, hopes to eliminate the traditional issue facing automated market makers through the following features uh, which we would see on the Instadex. Uh, one, impermanent loss insurance, and they are hoping to bring in single asset liquidity provisioning. Now, uh, for a liquidity pro providers who stick uh, to Instadex pool, they eventually get a 100-day uh, impermanent loss insurance. Those who withdraw their assets after 100 days or more will get more assets from the protocol to cover for any losses faced in the form of impermanent uh, losses. Now, in this scheme, a liquidity provider needs to remain invested in the pool for a minimum of 30 days or forfeit 
uh, the protection. In the same vein, if the liquidity provider decides to withdraw funds after 80 days, then only 80% of the insurance will be provided. Hence, the liquidity provider must remain uh, for about 100 days or more to be able to get this protection. Now, for single asset liquidity provisioning with Instadex, liquidity providers would no longer need to stake their favorite assets in order to join a liquidity pool. Rather, the liquidity providers can provide a single asset in the pool and take exposure only for that asset. Now, they can also have a choice to provide liquidity in Insta tokens. In this case, the asset provided will solely face the exposure, and the liquidity, prov liquidity provider will also receive uh, trading fees as well as other uh, compensation. So these uh, Instadex is eventually going to be launched on Testnet soon and it's going to be epic. So you're going to stay tuned to the Instadex channels to be able to get the proper uh, date for release. Now my thoughts on this is the fact that Instadex project is really worth giving serious attention as they have really achieved a lot within a very short time. Instaris is actually bringing um, a new innovation to the De Tezos DeFi uh, ecosystem via its uh, Instadex offering. Now, with this new system in place, liquidity providers will no longer have to worry about any loss they may face when one or more of the price determinants in the system is altered. Uh, also, knowing that the liquidity provider can now choose to actually provide liquidity on a single asset in the pool and take exposure only to that asset is indeed a master stroke. Now, this eventually uh, bridges the gap and will eventually position Instadex as a leading uh, DEX within the Tezos ecosystem. Also, uh, Instadex will be a great addition to the uh, launchpad and the incubation platform as it will enable Instarise to facilitate upcoming IDOs uh, via its native token, uh, that's the Insta tokens. This would then eventually help grow the value of the token as it will now be forced to be used in, in the systems. So uh, if you have any other information or questions you need to find out, you need to visit Instarize uh, website on instarize.io. You could actually check out the Telegram community uh, at Instarize and you could actually page for more information about the project. So um, you could actually also follow them on Twitter at Instarize and get all the information you need to get. So for now, it will be thank you for watching and have a good day.